Thank you for joining me for today's bird walk. It's a beautiful early spring day at the bay. All right, let's go birding. Oh, I hear a red-winged blackbird. Oh, it looks like there's a couple of them up in the tree there. Oh, there's a rufous hummingbird. Let's snag that first. That's a great start. You can hear the red winged blackbirds all around. I thought I saw them land in this tree. One that way to the left. Oh, there it is, one. And there's another one. Two of them. Let's see if we can find a little bit of an opening to get a sh clear shot. Coming out. There we go. Got the camera here. Oh, there goes the one. Where are you going? Where's your friend? Okay, well, let's just tuck into the marsh real quick here. Oh, I can hear that hummingbird. Let's just see if we can get a clear view from kind of this marshy part. Whoa! Oh, that was cool. That was a full flyby of a rufous hummingbird. <laughs> Guess he wanted a better shot. Nothing's jumping out at me right here, but there's lots of little places to peek at this uh, wetlands here, so we'll keep walking up the path. Seems like there's a lot of birds here today. Beautiful day for a walk. Looks like we've got a bunch of sparrows on the ground over here. Let's see what we've got. Like a short number of different sparrows. I'm seeing a white crown sparrows. Some golden crown sparrows. Some good junco. larger. There's a heron flying overhead. There's a heron. Okay, well, there's a few more sparrows in the ground. Let's just wander up here a little bit. Let's see if we can get some nice tight shots, maybe. This looks like the white crown. Oh, yep. So 
Man, they've got neat colorings. And you wouldn't normally see that unless you look at it through a lens of some sort. That's why binoculars are so great for burning. And a lot of times it's just a little variation to tell the difference in the species. Sorry guys, I'll try not to... Oh. This one seems to really want to swim. Okay, when they want their photo. Oh, maybe you don't. Okay. Oh, look. A swallow. Oh yeah, there's some swallows up there. Oh wow, this is a lot of activity right now. Let's just poke out here, stick to the program, get what we can. There's the black, red green blackbird. He touches down. Oh, there's the swallows making a ruckus. Okay, this looks like a good place to set up. Okay, lots to look at here. And a raven flying overhead. That was a raven's call. So the way I've got my camera set up is for autofocus is at pinpoint, so it's best if they're sit still like this guy is doing for us. See? We just have to find ones that like my stuff. What a great bird. And we left it. Yeah, so for this type of birding, for spotting birds and I like to have it set on um, pinpoint focus for when they land because I'm trying to get you know identifying bird photos and um, you know it's important to be able to pinpoint the focus on as opposed to trying to capture one maybe in the air flying on the ground. No shot, no single. Okay, what do we got there? And so, I think. I'm gonna grab the shot. Gonna check it out later. All right, let's keep moving around. There's lots of birds. Oh, it's a lot of fun. It's a gorgeous day. Wow. Oh, there's all these sparrows. Look at them all. Oh, there goes the heron. Spotted tohi up here. I actually thought it was a, a red winged blackbird, but it's a spotted tohi that's up there. I was going to set up here. There you go. Uh, hold steady in the wind. It's all right. Here we go. Keep moving.
That's so cool. Look at that. Oh, I saw the heron fly land way back in the marsh there. Let's just take a wide. And there's those swallows. Bird land here. Oh, there's a hummingbird up there, going way up and zooming down. Oh, is it in Anus? Yeah, it's an Anus on there, right? Let's go and see if we can get... So this one is the Anna's hummingbird. They've actually started to stay year around here. They're a little bit larger than the Rufus hummingbird and not quite as feisty. But as far as birds go, they're extremely feisty. Very territorial. All right. I could stick and photograph him all day, but there's so many birds here. I want to keep going, see what else we see. Always got to remember to slow down your pace when you're excited. You never know what you might scare away marching along. <laughs> Some geese way up there. Let's try. We got it on pinpoint autofocus. Let's see. All right, we might be able to identify from those. Maybe snow geese, maybe just Regular old Canadian geese. Oh, here's some juncos. Wow, it's a busy day. Okay. Nice coloring on that one. I mean, we got pretty harsh lighting now, but. Alright, I think I got the oh, I got over the a little bit wider. Oh. I heard that up there. Alright, let's uh keep moving on. The sun. Try not to disturb these guys too much, but I wanna peek down here. So let's go this way.
a cool spot. Seen a couple wood ducks here before. That'd be spectacular to see again. Okay. This not stand still too long. There's too many birds around. I'm just going to keep poking my head. Or I guess it's your head. <laughs> our head. I'm going to keep poking our vision. Our field of view. Into each one of these little spots. Cause... Oh. Red wing blackbird nice and close. Like the raven landed way up there. I want to grab a long distance shot of a raven. Cool. Why not? Some species today. So many birds up here. I haven't even looked out on the water. And not too sure what. Oh. Anything gonna grieve? All right. Well, let's keep keep wandering up here. I got a little bit of time left. I think the same usual suspects up there. Let's just keep poking our head in the... See if we can see anything there. Right oh. oh, I think that was a buried thrush. I just thrushed out of here. Oh, there's some buffalo ants. There were some buffalo ants. Here. You know, and sometimes you just are a little loud and scare them. And that's just part of it, too, as long as you're not trying to disturb them. There. There's a buffalo head down there. And then I know that they're so. Spooky. Yellow platter. Let's sit up here. 
here. Okay. Just take a shot real quick. I guess a better buffalo head shot is going to have to wait. I'm running out of time, so I've got to start headed back. If I see anything, I'll quickly get a shot. But if not, thank you very much for watching. And uh, please like and subscribe. I've got more videos coming. Thanks again. Let's get one last. It's always nice to end the video on a shot, so let's end it there. Okay. Enjoy the photos.